I would like to ask that question. Uh, you know, you mentioned all the problems we have, all the issues, and especially come down to Pakistan. So now we, the question is, why you are trying to do something in Pakistan? So, look, I mean, I always did it for Pakistan. I don't have a background in film. I understand the importance of this medium to make a nation. Uh, we have a very young population. The demographics say median age for Pakistan is just under 23. My messaging is primarily for the youth. Uh, you know, I grew up, I think that Pakistan deserves to be a lot better on for whatever reason it's hijacked, multiple things, youth is not getting the right opportunities, youth is not uh, being guided on the right, because just like you guys who are the youth, I got very little guidance. I had to go out and actually learn a lot from my, and luckily because I've traveled a lot and pretty much, I can't say more than anyone, but you know, I've, I've been to 50 countries. So that puts me pretty much, I would think, among the top most well-traveled people out of Pakistan. And most of those places I went on my own. And when I go, I expo exposure different languages, different cultures, food, uh, you're learning very quickly to fend for yourself. You know, you end up absorbing a lot. And I'm just that kind of person. I want to keep learning. But so why Pakistan is because of that. That someone with my exposure, with my uh, credentials, with my background, I'm at least going to give it a try. It's not easy. Very difficult. Why? Because the level of professionalism here, sadly, is lacking. Uh, are there capable people? Of course they are. I've just not met them. Majority of them. I mean, both are They're a very big country. And I'm certain that the level of capability lies in the younger generation. I have absolutely no doubt in my mind about that. Because... They're the ones who are more tech savvy. They're the ones who are ready to go on to mediums like YouTube and learn. How do I meet them? How do I get in touch with them? How do I encourage them and get a team going? Because this type of content creation is always a team effort. It cannot be done as a single person thing. I need the teams because I can give the vision. I can give the outline. I can't possibly do every single thing. And if I, the person like me who wants to do 8, 8, 10, 10 things at the same time, I need good, capable people who I say, here's what needs to be done, go do it. And they don't come back to me with if, ands, or buts, but they come back to me with almost 90% of it done. And then I'll step in and correct the small flaws that are, that's how it's done globally. Otherwise, you know, and mind you, even CEOs, big top level executives, same way. Bill Gates, Elon Musk, uh, Warren Buffett, you know, multiple other names globally. They're running 50, 50, 60, 60 companies. They're not running them themselves. They have managers. They have people under those managers who go, they tell them their vision, they execute, they come back. Okay, final steps can there again, they step in. That's where they're creative or your final video. Then a CEO level vision comes in. That's the person I am. And I've earned that. It's not that I'm saying, Gigi, I start out. I have over 20 years of very, very diverse business experience, not only in Pakistan, globally. And uh, I think I'm entitled to, you know, have that kind of, uh, call it helicopterish approach, where I'm looking over the whole project or multiple projects from a top level, not having to micromanage. Because if I have to micromanage, then, quite frankly, why do we need anyone? Exactly. And being a leader, it's very important to be a decision maker rather than to do it. Yeah. So, uh, yeah. it also raises a question, you know, from an industry, a person can might ask you that. If we hear Jami, he said, I'm like doing the art that i portraying the visuals of Pakistan. Like here, Kumayumai, he's saying, like, you know, I I made all of these dramas. Because of that, now I'm capable to make the films and we're producing it. And so many more. Fawad produced a lot of films as well. And Fawad is also going to be featured in Marvel as well. So, you know, with having a lot of... Marvel. Yeah. Uh, yeah. So, having a, uh, already a very uh, big uh, league of, you can say, producers here in Pakistan. And they are, you know, narrating themselves to be, you know, uh, heroes as well. 
how you see yourself and what a filmmaker can expect in Pakistan from you that how you will add that certain unique selling point in your product or in your content that will differentiate you from them. So again, exposure. First of all, experience. I've worked with the biggest names in Hollywood. Who have you worked with? I'm sorry, I'm not being mean over here, right? And it's not that anyone and everyone can work. All of अभी आपने खुद mention किया फवाद is getting into this marvel. How long has फवाद been acting and how long did it take him to land a little bitty animation role? Not because of me, right? I'm not stopping him. How many others are getting it? They're not because their scope of work, your body of work rather, is not that wide. Uh, nor are they unfortunately putting as much effort into enhancing it. They're trying. They go. They'll hire a PR manager and they'll try to get. Now, characterization. What is it? Why was Fawad taken? He was taken because Miss Marvel happens to be a Pakistani American yeah. character. Shamin so, uh, is part of that as well. Yeah. Who Shamin? Shamin. Yeah. 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 Uh, I was supposed to be a producer on that, but someone had a problem with that. So <laughs> <laughs> another story. But anyway, uh, not to get on that side, but. Look, even if uh, you take Humayun's name that you did, uh, Humayun has recently been taken for the Crown. Again, why? Because he looks like the original character. Yeah. So when you are talking about authenticity of content internationally, that's what they go on. They're not going to do it. That yar, I have made a movie. Okay, that's my friend. I'll put it in my bag. Or 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 I'll put it in my bag. करोड़ हाँ वो करोड़ रुपया ला देगा चलो उसको डाल देते हैं आप करोड़ छोड़ो दस ला दे भाजी का बेड़ा गर्क होगा इफ यू कांट डिलीवर यहाँ पे सैडली दैट इज वट इज गोइंग ऑन एंड लॉट ऑफ कॉन्टेंट वॉज मेड दैट वे एंड इट फेल्ड इट फेल्ड बिकॉज ऑफ सच रीजन बिकॉज द अंडरलाइंग रीजनिंग फॉर सिलेक्शन वॉज रॉन्ग I can make those mistakes too, and again, it comes down to teams, right? I also rely on team. Can I not make those mistakes? Of course, I can. I'm not perfect, but my uh, basic premise in doing any project is that project is important. I'm not important. Nobody is important. Project authenticity of project has to be. Otherwise, you know, I'll do one, I'll do two, and they're going to fail. And when they fail, I'm done. You can't say that. Sorry. I, you can't say that. It's failing. You can't say. You that. can't. You can't. No, I mean, but but who are you fooling? You're basically trying to fool yourself if you are going to. I mean, I, I think that people need to be the biggest critic critique of their own content themselves and think of it that this is your enemy's project, not yours. And take out all the things wrong with, because that's for your own good. It's going to improve the content. If you're going to take anything and say, "Nayji, I have made it perfect," I mean, is that same story? Every mother thinks their child is the most beautiful child in the world. We all know the reality is very different. Yeah. For the mother, yes, but the, I mean, not for the world. Everyone, everyone is not Brad Pitt, think, right? I Cannot be. You gave a very beautiful line that you need to see your content as your enemy. It, it, yeah. it, it, it needs to be a court. It's, it's a yeah. really good line. And uh, yeah. speaking of that, you know, obviously you are facing challenges in Pakistan while doing the work. We all know that. We are used to it. What are the positive things that you, uh, you know, came along here? And at the same time, uh, you know, what kind of projects we can expect from you? And can you give a little insights on the things coming from your side in Pakistan? So I've been working with a very good team on Bada, which is a message of unity, and uh, something I came up with about January 2021. Yeah. Uh, so Bada means promise, promise, right? Promise, yeah. And that's exactly what it's about. Kiji, basically, to remind people of the promise that Pakistan was created on, as you know, as a country. And what should have happened, and the unity. So the 
टैग लाइन ऑफ इट इज यूनिटी फेट डिसिप्लिन यू नो कायदे आजम थ्री गोल्डन वर्ड्स एंड दैट्स माय अ प्रोजेक्ट आई एम वेरी प्राउड ऑफ सो फार आई मीन इट्स नॉट कंप्लीटेड कंप्लीटेड बट इट्स लुकिंग वेरी वेरी यू नो वेरी वेरी स्ट्रांग इंशाल्लाह एंड आई होप आई कैन टेक फाइंड द राइट वे टू गेट इट आउट टू पीपल बिकॉज you know this is not a project that i'm doing for money it's fully funded by me uh, with any possible monetization going only to me to the level of what i have put in everything else would go into new projects and not for profit uh the goal is with that to you try and improve our loyalty to pakistan to improve uh you know our integration among different cultures of pakistan different languages different ethnicities of pakistan at the end of the day quite frankly i mean i have traveled pretty much not into the northern areas but otherwise pretty much all of pakistan and from a very young age i have businesses in the interior balochistan mein bhi hai and punjab mein bhi hai kp mein bhi hai so you know i have never cared to bother जी समन इज पठान समन इज पंजाबी सिंधी माजर आई डोंट गेट इट तो मैं क्या करूं आप जो भी हो मेरे लिए आप पाकिस्तानी हो आई रियली डोंट अंडरस्टैंड नहीं जी वो है सो एंड क्वाइट फ्रेंकली इवन ऑन द रिलीजियस साइड आई एम मुस्लिम आई है बट आई डोंट है राइट टू जज समन फॉर देयर रिलीजन एंड आई डोंट वॉन्ट टू एंड आई डोंट अंडरस्टैंड वाई इट्स बीन डन because it doesn't make you a bigger or better person you want to be a bigger or better person do that in yourself apne andar ko improvement karo apne andar ko corrections karo ki you are a bigger or better person because that's the only way it happens not by putting someone down sadly for whatever reason yahan pe ye ho gaya hai ki hum dusron ko neecha dikha ke apne aap ko behtar samajhte hain instead of focusing on our own selves like mind you focusing on your own self जो आपकी इंप्रूवमेंट होगी ना वो आपसे कोई नहीं ले सकता सो इट्स मोर लाइक uh different singers uh and it's also the video is going to showcase all of pakistan you know east to west north to south uh very beautiful colors maybe some of some things which we try to keep a lot of things which people have never seen as being in pakistan we've tried some will obviously not uh, some will be have been seen but some of the sites so i mean it would be even from a tourism perspective i felt that you know this would be perfect to show even on international places ki ji look this all is pakistan and um, you know so that's one then there's a couple of other projects i'm looking at thinking about but bandwidth ka issue aa raha hai again because i want to do 20 things one is resources and two is teams because even if i say my one existing team is very good i can't distract them and put them onto something else the project a is done it would not be fair to them also and yeah. mind you they also have other things besides just one project uh, because simply one project doesn't pay enough and especially when i am self funding it and it's not for profit we had to take as many favors as possible and uh, my, mind you i could have gone that route which you mentioned about branding and uh, you know in case of in the terms of wada it's because it's the 75th anniversary birthday of pakistan uh, 75th year of independence it's a very very big thing ki ji you know this for that from my perspective it's my gift to pakistan but uh could i have given it to a brand absolutely i mean i business partners with some of the pepsi bottlers and i know i can tell you i can probably sell this off for Seven eight crores, ठीक है. And that's a lot of money. I could use that money to make four five movies, but it would take away from brand Pakistan. So I've done this for Pakistan. So I can't attach any brand. 
because that brand does it may be a part of Pakistan, it's not Pakistan. Even myself, you will see, I have a very small cameo in it. I'm not even making it about myself. I've not put in any of my friends, any of my family members, you know, which because I was say, saying that authenticity of content is important. And that's what it comes down to. I could have obliged a hundred people all across Pakistan by putting them in. And by the way, it could have been done, but it would have taken away from the authenticity of it. So I didn't do it. So what, and you will see that. You will see that in terms of the uh, visuals that you're going to see people, for the most part, who are real people. No acting, there's no get-ups, there's no fake dress-ups for the most part. There are certain skits and stuff that had to be, obviously, but for the most part, it's, it's raw. just real raw. Yeah. So, that's because that's Pakistan, right? Exactly. So, on which platforms we can expect that? Are you planning to launch it on digital platform, on some OTT platform? Yeah. And can we expect it into the... Okay, I don't digital. think a music video can get onto OTT, frankly, I don't know. I don't think it can, but uh, uh, YouTube, of course, Facebook, uh, we just, I have a face, uh, YouTube page, we are trying to get it to a level of growth, uh, like this interview of ours is also going to be there also, and um, because it's my first thing, I've uh, again not for profit. So the idea is to maximize distribution because the messaging is important, right? So I want to make sure that it gets out as much as possible, uh, so that the agenda of it, which is unity, faith, and discipline, is uh, achieved. Now, so for that, I'll use any and all mediums that I have access to where I don't have to pay because, again, this is not for profit. So exactly. I don't have, uh, you know, I have all it, what it was supposed to cost. So, you know, there's a limit to how much I can do. So I, uh, not going to tell someone that you have a PR campaign. I would hope that people would, you know, try and push it out because the content is that good. And I think these days people do. Uh, yeah. The number of people, if you see the TRPs of Coke Studio versus the number of views they get onto something like YouTube, huge difference. Yeah. Uh, replays up allo, up Coke Studio pe TRP agar aap laga le, I think three four ke kareeb hota hai, itna hota hai, if that. So if it's, it's very high for Pakistan. If it's all about like Pakistan and you know, the diversity, can, can we expect it to be on Expo as well? The way I'm, not, I'm not sure if the Dubai Expo is going to be running. I believe it's ending. So, if it is, I'll try and get it there. I'm actually going to Dubai tomorrow. So, I'll talk to people there and see. If it can be, absolutely, I would put it. I, I'd love to because, again, look, for me, what do I gain out of it? Exactly. One, uh, and then again, goes back to also your original question of why in Pakistan. I am Pakistani. I've traveled all over the world. I come from a family which contributed a lot to Pakistan. My grandfather gave a blank check for Pakistan at formation when Pakistan didn't have money. He was mayor of Karachi, other things, some I can't talk about. But, you know, wherever in the world I go, I'm Pakistani. I can be the richest person on the planet, it won't change. Shahid Khan is the richest Pakistani. He's known as American, but he's Pakistani, yeah. you know. Uh, so, that's why. Because, it's embarrassing, for the lack of a better word, when I see that what's happening and the world is where we are reaching and where we are reaching and where we are fighting and where we are fighting and where we are fighting and where we are you know, so, you know, sometimes it's a disaster, sometimes it's something, sometimes it's something. Bro, let's focus on our people. Leave everyone. Forget everything. Our people. Pakistanis. For Pakistan, build in Pakistan, think for Pakistan. I have full sympathy for everything that wars are going on, other things. Non Safiya Hotiya Dunya Me. Either come in. Amne Unka Thika Liya. Pele Apne Kodar Thik Karle. Apna Thik Oni Ra. Apne Logon Kik Masita Thik Ni Hoti Vir. So for that reason, you know. And it's embarrassing because I am Pakistani and it hurts me when I see. Log, some of them who are very capable. When people tell us, Ji, prime, last Prime Minister, Imran Khan Sahib would always talk about 
کہ جی اوورسیز پاکستان از اے ویری بگ ریسورس آف پاکستان نو ڈاؤٹ وائی بیکاز دے سینڈ یو سو مچ منی ہیز اینی ون ایور سیٹ ڈاؤن اینڈ تھاٹ اباؤٹ دا فیکٹ وائی از اٹ دیٹ سو مینی کیپیبل پاکستانیز اینڈ اپ گیونگ Why are we not able to create a fair environment for them in Pakistan? So that that capability is not going there and just sending a bit pittance back and is actually making that things there. Whatever the inventions are, whatever the health care is. Why is it that Pakistani doctors, there's over, I think over 100,000 doctors in America, some of the best doctors, cardiologists, neurosurgeons, okay? Why could we not create an ecosystem in Pakistan that people who are coming from the world and come and come and come and come and come and come? Why doctor? Why can't we give, facilitate them here? Why does everyone have to leave to be recognized? And we are not recognizing them. I am recognized globally. I am not recognized here. Right? So, for that reason, to make that change, I, and it's not easy because, unfortunately, in Pakistan, for the most part, talent, real talent, real capability, intelli- intelligence, intellect is not appreciated. The norm is mediocrity. Just like it's going on, it's going on. Okay. Just like it's going on, it's going on. It's going on. So how you would like to, you know, inspire or connect with the, with the youth and the new future filmmakers? Uh, because if we see by myself, like there, I see very few producers, young people, Producers in the industry. A lot of people want to be a uh, you know, DOP, cameraman, director, actor, a big lot of actors. But why are we lacking a good producers? And how Again, do you think you can fill that? Well, I can't fill all of it. Oh, impossible. Okay. My goal was that if I even eventually get into a point where I have my own studio, I have my own, let's say, channel, all of those things. Uh, I'll be one of many, right? I can't possibly take all the content. I can't. So even if I grow really big, I probably take 10, 15, 20% of the market, if that. And that would be a very big org- organization. I mean, you're talking at that level, almost a billion dollar company. Yeah. But, uh, you know, others have to step up. And don't just count on me. I'm one person. Yeah. I'm, But, talking, uh, I'm talking collectively. Uh, what do you think we can do to encourage that. You know, we need to break that stereotypic the whole, you know, someone from the whole is is a landlord, he is a producer. Uh, we need to change. I think anyone can do it. Yeah. Anyone can do it. So, uh, I, I feel that one thing, first of all, if your content, again, and content is not judged by your camera, it's first of all your story. Uh, there are multiple examples throughout film history where content has been shot even on handy cams exactly. and has made it all the way. Uh, hundreds of millions of dollars in revenue. So, you know, you, if you really want to focus, it's a time of today, start doing, can you shoot everything? Of course not. Tailor your content, just like you would tailor the product placement. Tailor your content into something which can be done with whatever resources you have available. Yeah, uh, you need to start. Hand hand yeah, you start. If it's good, okay, if you don't have the budget for a feature, Short. Don't store for Don't. the day you, you, you will produce a Transformer, Transformers or Avatar, just start from the Is every movie in Hollywood a Transformer? No. Exactly. How many of those movies come out every year? Exactly. You know, so aspire to that, but you can't start there. You have to build up. And again, that will only happen if the quality of content you make is powerful, meaningful, and it connects with the audience that you're making it for. The best thing you have, again, if it's cheaper content, YouTube, you don't even need a TV, uh, OTT. Uh, I mean, I've seen some of the numbers. There's actually models in India, uh, company, T-Series is one I've heard of. They only make content for YouTube channel. And AK content keeper, مطلب دیو میڈ سانگ حیرت یہ ہوتی ہے دیو میڈ سانگ وچ آر اباؤٹ لاہور رائٹ دیر از ویری فیمس اٹ ہیز ایف آئی ایم ناٹ مسٹیکن اوور ٹو ہنڈریڈ ملین ویوز سو دے مسٹ ہیو جنریٹیڈ ایٹ لیسٹ فورٹی ففٹی تھاؤزینڈ ڈالرز آؤٹ آف اٹ از دیٹ ناٹ انف فار ون سانگ ایز اے کروڑ روپیز رائٹ 
and I'm taking a very very low number in terms of monetization. Exactly. Probably a lot higher. Yeah. So, your YouTube it all. चलो पहला नहीं होगा आपको फीडबैक मिल जाएगा यू नो अगेन सोशल मीडिया इज अ वेरी पावरफुल टूल व्हिच इज गिविंग यू द वे आई मीन व्हाट आर दीस टिकटॉक स्टार्स एंड इंस्टाग्राम इन्फ्लुएंसर्स एंड इंस्टाग्राम यूट्यूब जो ये जो है कंटेंट क्रिएटर्स देयर देयर मोनेटाइजिंग इट सो यू हैव अ चैनल दैट यू कैन डू इट ऑल सो इज दैट so it it uh, comes on to a question that is like uh, related to production and uh, being a producer you know obviously we say yes to scripts but how you say no to a script and what's the best possible answer other than like saying yes to to a idea or image so i internationally not local i am trying not to take on much locally right now because i do have too many things going on uh internationally i get about two scripts a day most of them i don't even bother to respond and it's not being the method elite or wrong yeah it's a bandwidth issue right i can't do everything now what will i do i'll do something if it's really up there so after 2020 when covid started the first project i've signed up for now is the animation called the inventor why did i do it it's the first project i'm doing which is with an academy award winner director who did ratatouille he was number 2 or number 3 at pixar uh you know so it's adding to me i'm not doing it just to do it i'm doing it because i will be working with an academy award winning director in animation because i want to get into animation in pakistan pakistan has 60 million kids under 15 there's zero local content coming even if i've heard recently brainy tunes has just started i need to get back to those guys they have reached out to me uh you know it needs to be done what are we showing why are we not doing we have 60 million audience guaranteed with no competition right now How am I going to do it? Should I just? Because I know that I have to hire six people overnight. Six people to hire. Tell me, tell me, we are making it. I'll fail. I won't fail. I, there's no competition, but I won't do it justice. So I took on the animation project. I took it on with an Academy Award-winning director. Whatever I learn, types of uh, techniques they're using. Uh, I'm supposed to go. It's in short in France, so I have to go for a couple of days later on in the year. uh it's already in process it's a very long i can't take that much time but i'll go for a few days i'll understand i'll ask the questions i have so it's like a master class for me right i'll go i'll do i'll come back i'll be ready that puts me at a higher level of qualification than again because i'm not the guy who's going to be coding and i'm not the guy who's going to be the technical guy but in terms of understanding how do you build the stories because that's what a producer has to do so that's why i've taken it so you know so that's the thing ki ji how to say no very easy if it doesn't add to you say no because you have limitations of time so you have there are three things in life you have money you have uh, time and you have your intellect generally anything you do is going to take a combination of those three to get done and if you're lacking one of them the other two should compensate and make up for the third if you have to put all three and continue to put all three why are you doing it? wasting your time your money and your internet and your time yeah, it makes all three it makes sense honestly so uh, any last message you want to give it out there to your audience or uh, any expectation you have for you anything that you 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 might give an insight for the future you're planning um i guess primarily to the youth of pakistan because i have a lot of hope in them i think like me we all want to see pakistan to be a flourishing country a peaceful progressive positive balanced country uh, i want we all want to feel proud that we, we are proud 
बट वी वॉन्ट टू बी प्राउड नॉट जस्ट कि जी चौदह अगस्त को झंडा है लाल है बट वी वॉन्ट टू बी प्राउड ऑफ आर अचीवमेंट कंट्री लेवल पे एंड वॉन्ट टू सी आर कंट्री स्टैंडिंग अप विद अदर कंट्रीज एज एन अचीवर वी वॉन्ट टू बी पार्ट ऑफ दैट अचीवमेंट सो I uh, that is my message yaar keep at it don't get distracted by politics because let me tell you one thing no matter who the politician is if you think there is a miracle pill that someone's going to come and is going to be able to magically change your life no the only person that can change your life is you and that is only going to happen when you take ownership and you start to utilize your time on learning because the more you learn that learning no one can ever take free resources hain youtube hai you know baki ye jo hote hain aapke master classes wagaira aajkal udemy and a couple of others you can buy annual subscriptions for 20 30 dollars if you can't afford the 20 30 dollars you can actually do single courses short courses which are like 6 7 if you can't afford that join with a couple of friends buy it together and share the password you can do it one after the other you can sit together and do it so uh, i don't think while money is an important factor i don't think it's such a large amount of money that people can't muster up the resources for those who genuinely want to do it because you're talking 1000 1500 rupees 2000 but it's not a ground breaking amount ke ji bank toot jayega uh baki uh, like i said focus on yourself and use their time wisely because uh, you know if i a person in my position if i uh, started doing sadly what majority of our people here tend to do i don't need to work and here i am taking on 10 10 things at the same time i should just retire <laughs> right but instead of that i am saying nahi i want to do or you know, not for money you know, I mean, money has to be there to make things work but it's for achievement so if if your goal is actually to achieve the money will come with achievement if you're good it will happen i am the greatest example of that is some of our freelancers who are sitting at home and earning thousands of dollars a month <coughs> these days because they learned a lot of them are self taught woh youtube wagaira dekh ke baki coding seekh li and they're sitting and they're earning thousands of dollars well done i hope a lot more people uh, uh, that's the right way exactly and, and you'll have all these other people sitting and being like itna kama rahe hain to bhai kaam kar rahe hain na kamane do aapko kya hai i think more things like that need to come out we need to contribute back to society and i really love the approach and the passion you have Uh, as well you know uh, for for this country like much more than us and you know it it it's actually shock gave a shock to me that why is such a big uh, successful producer who come back to this country to produce content here while producers of our country trying to go there and you know run uh, it's not just our producers is everyone trying to go unfortunately jisko mauka milta hai bhag jata exactly and mulk kaise banega agar har koi bhag jayega to analo par kuch nahi ban sakta exactly so it it was really inspiring i hope to have a, a further more uh, you know content from your side from your production from your channel as well and we would like to share that as well with the youth other than that if any uh, of the you know filmmakers future filmmaker or the people from our industry and the audience want to have any question and want to reach out uh, us you know regarding any matter they can do that and please do share that thing as well with the people who wants to be part of this fraternity uh, this industry so you know they can have something out of it uh, it as well and it's it goes same with me abhi i learned everything through youtube and through observation so it's very important very well said thank you so much for your time uh, and thank I you and all, all the good luck and all the good wishes for you for every single venture out there thank you very much yaar thanks a lot very good